The Wendy Williams Show has become one of the most popular daytime talk shows on TV since it debuted in July of 2008. Show host Wendy Williams has a unique personality with the mix of interviews that she does with celebrity guests that can come from television, film, music, and sports, along with the segments such as Ask Wendy and hot topics that make the show entertaining and often unpredictable. At the nine seasons in and over 1,500 episodes, there have been a lot of great and crazy moments in the Wendy Williams show. And if you can use some laughs, stay tuned as we show you some of the best and craziest Wendy Williams moments. But before we get into the video, make sure you like the video and subscribe to our channel. One of the most memorable moments of the show was when Wendy was in the middle of talking to someone when she suddenly turned to the audience and said, turn off your phone. It was life changing for Wait, me on many me. levels. Excuse me, Kenya. Yes. Turn off your phone. Oh. Whose phone is singing along? Yes. There I go, Ma, that's <laughs> my- Before trying to find out whose phone was ringing by fishing the audience, the show host was even more shocked when she found out that the girl whose phone it was had been interrupting was sitting in the front row. Front row? <laughs> Are you serious? But once she asked who was calling, the girl revealed that it was her alarm for being on the Wendy Williams show. And Wendy found that rather amusing since the girl would have been pretty late if she had paid attention to her alarm. <laughs> You would have been late if you paid attention to that. Now, Wendy Williams clearly loves her audience and affectionately calls them co-hosts. So it is hardly surprising that she enjoys walking through the ranks, talking to them during the Ask Wendy segments. Because her show is broadcasted live, her crew will always tell her how much time she has left for each segment. And when they tell her there were only 30 seconds left in one show, Wendy looked around for a moment trying to decide how to best use the time before inviting her co-hosts to dance with her. Since Kevin Hart is an actor and comedian, some would expect his appearance on the Wendy Williams show to be pretty funny, and he didn't disappoint. The best part was when Wendy made him sit in the hot seat, asking him 40 to 100 degree questions. After trying to name several instead of just the best comedian by saying their names really quickly, Hart then told a hilarious story about meeting David Hasselhoff. After telling Hoff how much he liked Knight Rider and started to sing the theme song, the star of his childhood just walked off, leaving Hart pretty awkward. That song, and I was like, didn't, didn't, didn't. He, he just walked off. <laughs> and that wasn't the only word encounter with the celebrity that he's had, since meeting Janet Jackson didn't apparently go much better either. And she just made a face at him after Hart introduced himself and said that she must like little guys. Though it might have been down to the comedian that it turned out to be awkward at this time. And I'm like, hey, Janet, um, my name's Kevin Hart. I'm a big fan. I was like, you must like little guys. And she was like, <laughs> she was like, ugh. Like, now, one of the best traditions on the Wendy Williams show is the annual end zone dance off as part of the Super Bowl festivals. Turn down the Turn down the in which three members of the studio audience compete against each other to find out who does the best touchdown dance. The audience then votes their favorite and decide who goes home with the prize. While the competition is always entertaining, this year's winner certainly surprised a lot of people with her moves and also made Wendy Williams happy by doing a full split. And that'll do it for today's video. Hope you guys really enjoyed it. Again, make sure to leave a like on the video and also subscribe to the channel. If you are a new viewer, let us know down below in the comments if you enjoyed the video and if you did subscribe and we'll see you next time.